There's talk of eliminating uh, lifeguards mm. uh, at the two city public beaches, I believe at Rogers Cove and Beaver. And Beaver Reed, that's right. Uh, yep. A savings of about, uh, last I heard was about $28,000. Uh, it could be, could be more, could be a little more than that. Um, you know, I, I get it, you're looking for savings all the time, mm -hmm. uh, but savings that are kind of connected to public safety, what are your thoughts on that? It's not really an area I would think that you'd really want to cut corners on. Yeah, and um, it's been a tough budget year, as you know, uh, in terms of, you know, first of all, we normally don't do it in January, but dealing with uh, different uh, circumstances of the province and all of that. Um, so staff were very diligent about looking for any cost savings that they could find. Mm -hmm. uh, and that was one of the recommendations. Um, again, very uh, controversial and, and problematic in a lot of ways uh, because, you know, we don't want to be jeopardizing anybody's safety or health and enjoyment of our public facilities. So, yeah, um, yeah I mean, and again, it's, it's a, that's a small amount of money in the grand scheme of the city budget, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Uh, $28,000 yeah. is... Um, you know, we, you know, staff spend that on things that we don't even hear about on a daily basis, right? Sure. Um, yeah. And uh, so, yeah, I think there was a lot of very good discussion about that. And um, yeah, I mean, I'm not, you know, in favor of it. It's a, it's a, yeah, it's a tough call because we had some folks too that you know work in those areas saying, well, we help clean the beach and pick up these needles and that and but that's and that's not what lifeguards should be doing there right like we have public works that are handling the yes um you know that are handling those things and we don't want um, high school students having to deal with potentially dangerous items yeah, so sure. there's a little yeah. bit of education that needs to happen on that front yeah as well and and you prefaced everything by saying um you know the final vote on the budget uh is still to come yeah uh so s any one of these things could be adjusted Still. Absolutely. Yep. You know, I yep. mean, who knows how the discussion will go. Yep. So we should make it clear these aren't kind of like done deals. Nothing's finalized yet. It's all. Yeah. yeah it's we you know we had the pre committee met finance committee and that was the preliminary discussion, but yep. it's not final until January twenty seventh. And and for people to know, and I think it's important. I mean, staff is has direction, and their direction is to do exactly what they've done here. Yeah. And that's to find uh, economies, find savings, find places where you know you can still run the city yeah. but maybe be able to save a few bucks here and, and they there. bring it to us and then we have the discussions about whether or not we want to so you're the bad advice. guys we're basically. the bad guys <laughs> <laughs> okay, at the end of the well, day we knew that right <laughs>